Cheryl, before the sun set today at Crown Hill Cemetery outside Indianapolis, an I-Team camera at the cemetery where John Dillinger is buried, the only gravesite as far as the eye can see that has flowers. The marker, 1934, when Dillinger was killed by G-Man in Chicago. And now tonight, the I-Team with news that the notorious outlaw will continue to rest in peace, at least for the time being, after a court decision today. I just want the answers for the truth. All these years, there's been rumors. The truth, according to Mike Thompson, is that his uncle John Dillinger may not have been gunned down by the FBI here outside Chicago's Biograph Theater, meaning the body buried in this grave for more than 85 years wouldn't be that of the infamous gangster. That's why Thompson came to Marion County Superior Court this morning with his attorney, Andrea yes. Simmons. Mike Thompson has a legitimate reason for learning the identity of the person in the grave. And um, we've done everything we were supposed to do. We've gotten Department of Health permits. We have no objections from family members. And we're hopeful the court will do the right thing. It didn't work out that way today in court for Dillinger's kinfolk. Judge Timothy Oakes heard both sides and then granted a dismissal of Mike Thompson's lawsuit, saying cemetery permission was required under state law. Thompson wanted the court to clear the way for a New Year's Eve exhumation of the body buried here, and then he would have DNA tests run for positive identification. If his uncle was anonymous, if no one had ever heard the name, we wouldn't be here today because Crown Hill or any other cemetery in Indiana would have worked with the family to get it done. Some Dillinger relatives opposed digging up the body and showed up today at court. The dead should be left alone. This sh just should never have gotten this far. Um, I think it is very disgraceful. The other side of the Dillinger family has 30 days now to file an appeal. Their attorney a few minutes ago telling the I-Team they will be exploring other legal options that are available and expect to have a plan in place within the next few weeks. Regardless, the New Year's Eve plan is off. The FBI doesn't see a reason for any of this, saying it's a myth that Dillinger wasn't killed by agents and someone else is buried there. So hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.